Hello, this tool is looking at the export sheets to DWG command inside the Graytech Power Pack. So the first thing just to be aware when you're using this functionality, it does require you, if we come up here to our CAD formats and export, it does require some exports set up. Okay, so we tend to have these set up anyway within a project, but we just need to make sure that we have them set up. So as you can see here, I've just created three, one architecture, one MEP and one structures. When we go to use the command, let's just come out of this, and um, we use the export sheets DWG button, okay, you can see in here that the export settings, that it's brought them over here, so we can use them inside here. What this function allows us to do is to do a multiple export at the same time. So for example, if we just cancel out of this and we look at this drawing down here, we can see under sheets, we've got several drawings. If we go back to export sheets and we use our Revit architecture one, we can select the drawings that we want to export at the same time. We can give it a variable list name. Okay, so this one's using the project name, year, month, date. So again, this can be customized by you as the user. And down here, we can choose the file type. So is it a 2013, 2010, or 2007 DWG? If we select that, again, we have that tick box that we have inside our standard export inside Revit, which is export views and sheets, and make them XREFs. We'll press OK on this. So it's asking us for a location. So again, I can go to my PC, and if we just go down to my C drive, and I have an export to DWG directory already made, press OK. It's going to take a few seconds to do this, because as you can appreciate, we're expo exporting multiple drawings at the same time. This will also look at exporting the PCP files to go with it. So we're taking all of the data out at the same time. So if you imagine this on a, a large project, we can do a, a multiple dump if you like. If we go to our D directory, we can see all of that information has come out. So we've got our drawings and we've got our PCP files. When we open these in AutoCAD, it, this is standard Revit now. So if we bring this into AutoCAD, Like so, just let that load in. We can see it's brought the DWG, so this is the floor plan one. And if we go to our model space, we can see it's brought in all the correct layering system that was tied to my Greytech architecture. Okay, thanks for watching.